water sign this is your next seven day reading so if your sun moon rising or venus sign is in the sign of pisces cancer or scorpio shout out to the pisces watching happy pisces season um but yeah this um this is for you i have a lot of energy today so please don't mind me i'm gonna try not to yell in your ear are we comfortable are we okay drink something get comfortable let's get into it okay water sign i don't know how to tell you this i don't but everything is going to work out and i don't know who what where when you may not know how it's going to work out like you're sitting here you're wondering what is going to happen next okay this could be pertaining to a connection uh something specific you know like how am i going to make ends meet this month this week whatever you're wondering these things or maybe just like overall you're like in this funk it's all working out allow space for spirit and the universe to like handle things for you water sign you're trying to figure out something you're trying to plan you're trying to look within yourself for answers you're meditating on this it's out of your hands is what i'm feeling and this is a really good thing because just like great things are going to happen um so water sign you're not going to understand how things uh fell into place for you they simply are i don't know if this is pertaining to your next seven days um you know but just in general like whatever you're stressed about right now water sign is going to be completely fine and it's like you're not going to understand how it even worked out and played out like that how did i end up getting this position i'm not even qualified for this how did how did i manage to save my relationship save my marriage how did this person like randomly decide that they you know want to commit to me and out of the blue like they're coming back to me and they're showing you know through action that they are devoted to me you just have no idea it's none of your business just enjoy the show enjoy the rodeo enjoy the journey <laughs> enjoy the journey that is life like go of control issues water sign let's do it all together on the count of three let's release any doubt worry stress insecurities amen to that and so it is overall energy please for the water signs <clears throat> overall energy please overall energy for the water signs please something about the clouds you have your head up in the clouds you are admiring the clouds something about the sky um, i'm also getting watercolors so like water paint you know like yeah like watercolors um let's see we got blessings yep um, being out in nature, uh, birds chirping, beautiful. I don't know if this is your dream state. I don't know if this is your physical environment, but beauty surrounds you. Take a moment to express gratitude. Thank yourself. Thank the universe. Thank everything that has contributed to bringing you where you are today. More blessings are coming in, but we have to express gratitude. Voyage. Some of you have something to look forward to, some type of new journey, new beginning, uh, of course, a trip that you're looking forward to, healing chaos, okay, I'm hearing the sweet escape, things have been very chaotic, unsettling, uneasy for you for quite some time, I definitely relate to this, but all of that is being healed, all of that is being handled, it's out of your hands, you don't, you see the tornado here, you don't try to control a tornado, no human is going to look at a tornado and be like, I can control this and help maneuver it into another you know the opposite direction of me you know you can't do these things this is a force of nature and this is what i'm telling you about the universe having its hand on how things are playing out in your life right now allow divine timing to unfold itself and heal you do you understand you're putting a lot of pressure on yourself to pick up all the pieces and you know what you you've done great thus far water sign allow the universe to do the rest for you security stability is coming you and your loved ones are safe if you're worried about your home if you're worried about your loved ones if you're worried about safety anything that may threaten some type of structure and stability that you have you are protected and you are going to be safe you and your loved ones anyone that is you know struggling right now that you're worried about it may not even be you that you're worried about but they're going to be safe we got leadership 
Okay, so I see you taking some type of action or I see um, some action like taking place that helps bring on more action. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like someone's taking some type of lead or something is being initiated and there's, you know, taking risk. Wow. Yeah. Someone takes a leap of faith in the next seven days. Okay, let's see what the tarot has to say, please. Let me get some more insight on this uh, this blessing. I mean, I almost don't want to ruin the surprise for you, but I'm just going to see like whatever spirit um, wants to share regarding this blessing, just so that you kind of, when it does happen, or when you get hints, you know, you know you'll know, you be like, okay, like V told me about this. Like, this is what she was talking about. So let me just get some insights on this, um, on these blessings. This is plural, honey. Don't forget the S at the end of that. It's not one blessing. It's multiple. It is a plural word, okay? Plural version of the word. Let's see, um, what do these blessings and or how will we be how will we be able to know what these blessings are about how do we know what these blessings pertain to please spirit for the water signs oh my god oh my god <laughs> i don't know i'm feeling so no this is too much because look look like i'm not i don't look do you see do you see this is how the cards fell do you understand that this is the lover's card and then this is the two of cups. Do you understand? Do you understand the sense of unity that is coming through right now? Like, can you even comprehend the lovers and the two of cups? So this surely is love related or this could just be you, you know, finding your tribe. Who else had this message? Um, Air signs had this message. And look at that, air sign energy coming through. So you could be dealing with a Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. Okay. Wow. Yeah, nine of swords. So, okay. So I'm getting some of you are working through counseling. If you are in an unhappy marriage, let's say, or if your job is like just like there's like a lack of harmony when it comes to your work okay i'm seeing you going to like hr or something like that uh for some i'm seeing like couples counseling i'm seeing therapy so support is being given to you in order to restore some type of balance okay this could also pertain to a family dynamic it doesn't have to only be romantic anything where you feel as though like you need help with like especially if it's pertaining to like housing some type of support uh, i'm also getting if you are a student and you need like more time on something on an essay or something like that you may be, be you may be able to discuss that with your ta or whatever it is okay so i see you you know collaborating and getting support here this is amazing at the bottom of the deck we have the five of cups which is exactly the energy of healing chaos healing this uh this loss that we had okay feeling as though you were left out in the cold okay um no more crying over spilled milk i always say that on my channel when it comes to the five of cups um yeah the queen of cups so this is you water sign like i can't like no like you're really finding someone that completes you like you're really like i don't i don't even know what to tell you um but i will say that the next seven days bring on the sense of hope and the sense of inspiration within you i feel so you're going to get re-inspired you're going to get passionate about something and it's going to help lead you in the right direction okay your relationships are really looking good especially romance especially romance passion ignited lots of sex coming in um creativity abundance if you uh i'm guessing also you're gonna be very busy likely with the work but this is a good thing i'm getting like sporadic payments okay if you have like your own company if you sell services sporadic payments uh lots of excitements there is also a lot of movement surrounding you right now so i don't know if you are just like physically moving around a lot or you could be traveling a lot a lot of like short distance uh like traveling a lot of commuting okay back and forth you have to go to the office you got to go to your your event space or whatever it is lots of back and forth okay so uh yeah um hierophant card yeah i'm also getting your back and forth like between your your place and your partner's place um okay let me see strength card okay interesting let's 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 pull some cards we got the three of cups sorry the three of swords three of wands 
uh, the full card, yeah, definitely. So I feel as though the stakes are higher now, um, Water Sign. I don't know like what this new beginning is that you're embracing. I feel so some of you are going to be accepting some type of like internship, something abroad, something that just feels like new territory for you. Even if it's not you physically being in a new environment, you're starting something new. So I feel as though you are uh, allowing yourself to embrace like the excitement and the newness in like the now. Um, I'm also feeling as though um, the stakes are higher this time. So you could be uh, in a place, in a position of power, you have more responsibility than before. So it feels like there's a lot of hard work here. Let's say that you are moving. I feel as though some of you are like, I'm here in Arizona, um, but I just feel as though some, some of you are moving somewhere hot. I feel as though you're moving to like another state, another province, or some of you are even going to another country that is of a warmer climate. Okay. So, um, let's say for example you are moving like let's say that i feel so now you have like a lot more responsibility of course because you have to like start over essentially you have to find a job you have to you know find a place to live hopefully you already have that but i just feel so there's more pressure on you it's not a bad thing though i feel so you're really excited about this new chapter in your life some of you like you're thinking about marriage you're thinking about um getting back together with someone okay so getting back into a relationship or you're thinking about remarrying so maybe you're not marrying you know your ex wife your ex spouse or whatever but i feel so you're like reopening up you know like what you thought about commitment or something like that there's something definitely here that you're revisiting when it comes to your past your upbringing your family's upbringing let's say you grew up in a broken home you never seen yourself really settling down or having like that fairy tale ending well let me tell you you're having it <laughs> you're having it okay we got the high priestess yeah so your intuition is leading you um, towards like this new adventure okay I'm also seeing uh, an event an event uh, uh, sorry this this is making me think about an anniversary it's someone's birthday you're celebrating you're celebrating you know four years of marriage um, again I'm getting a wedding so I'm getting you're preparing a uh, an invitation that you're going to be giving out to people you're pre you're preparing some type of event or you are invited to one okay any type of social gathering you are guided to in like just do it please i'm getting emphasis here on venus in taurus and venus in aries yeah the death the death card and the six of cups a lot of you are going to be reuniting with a soulmate i don't know if you've met this person before uh you may meet them while you are they may be like mutual friends of yours there's emphasis here on like a family friend someone that feels familiar to you you may meet them um while you are visiting your childhood town um or maybe they come from you know your your childhood town like you know, maybe you were born and raised in like you know one country but then you go to another country and then you meet someone of your country your national whatever like you know you guys know what i'm saying there's it's just so many vibes like i don't know what else to like even say especially if you have scorpio placements i feel like this is for you scorpio or cancer placement especially it's giving so many vibes i see you putting an end to something especially like a thought pattern um you're you're moving on from that you're embracing something uh very exciting yeah wipe those tears water sign okay save those tears for another day or whatever the weekend said there's really no reason for you to beat yourself up over the past. There's no reason for you to hold on to it. Any pain, resentment, sadness, sorrow that you've experienced in the past, please release it. I already told you guys, I said three, two, one, we're releasing all of that um, because it really is behind us now. And I see, I see um, something about repairing. Something is being fixed. Something is being like actively worked on. You may be getting experts helping you out with this. Like I said, counseling, for instance, but you're getting the support that you need. Okay. And if this is not counseling, then this is like financial support. Like, you know, people are supporting your business, your art, like whatever leap of faith that you're making or that you're thinking of making this next seven days is bringing in the blessings. Again, I didn't want the universe to, um, well, I didn't want spirit to like ruin the surprise for you, but the blessings do pertain most likely to this feeling of happiness. <laughs> it pertains to love. It pertains to soulmate energy. Like, I don't know. I just feel so much positivity, positivity from the cards. You've been crying and stressing and 
worrying about the same things over and over again there's been just so much that you have had to accomplish and overcome in such a short amount of time you barely had time to reflect you barely had time to check in with yourself you were trying to hold it all together for your family for your friends for the people around you that were dependent on you um for your children you know and it was it was it was a lot and there were times that you could have definitely walked away called it quits you could you could have done whatever but you didn't you stuck it out okay and i don't usually believe in like I mean, yeah, I kind of do. Like, my inner Scorpio does understand that it's really like a give and take when it comes to just transmuting energy. When it comes to being an alchemist, like, you need to have energy in order to, like, this, turn your lemons into lemonade, basically is what I'm trying to say. Like, that's just how to alchemize. I'm not going to get into that too much, but, um, yeah, okay, <laughs> 15 minutes in, let's get some, um, let's see what your angels have to say. Any more messages, please, for the water signs? I'm getting something is going to take uh, three days. If it doesn't take three days, if you're saying three days is not realistic, then it's three weeks, okay? But um, I'm getting, like, a group project. I'm getting a group of people coming together and helping plan something. I'm also getting something about your, your person and their family. So I don't know if you are meeting their family or if your person is going through, like, family issues, family drama. But I feel so it's like, you know maybe the parents of your person they don't approve of you they don't approve of this marriage this union but you get along with their siblings uh something like that and they're showing you their support so the people that have your back the people that want to celebrate you that love you they're making themselves known um in the next seven days you are so loved water sign you are so loved i hope you feel it i really hope you feel it because you are so loved let me see, um, what do we have? Oh my God. Of course, this card falls. It says, wait for a sign. It says, wait for a sign. Because the universe is sending blessings your way. So watch out for synchronicities. Oh my gosh. Listen to your intuition. If you feel like in your gut that this person's going to propose to you, or you're feeling like you're going to meet a soulmate soon or you feel like you're gonna get the job you feel like there's this positive change that is gonna happen in your life you are absolutely correct water sign you're very in tune you know this this is what you do this is what we do this is what we're here for a letting letting ourselves you know flow like water adapt but wait for a sign you know, I was just talking about water and look at this whale, like really chilling. Okay, this, of course, this picture is like abstract because the whale is like floating and there's like a smaller whale. Under. Yeah, if, especially if you have a child, like especially if you are like a single parent with your child, like you are, you have so much that you have to be proud of for like just the way that you've been holding it down is just absolutely phenomenal. A lot of you have just had such little support and like help and you feel like you did all of it alone and like you just you did absolutely amazing you just have so much to be proud of yourself for but yes that's what I was saying with the whale here kind of like making its way slowly but surely you know on top of the ocean I feel so you're slowly but surely finding your way you're finding your voice you're finding your path um, you're not being like you're not you know going about it in like an egotistical way like you're not being cocky about it like look at me look at me look at what i'm doing look at the universe you know providing for me and all that things like you're feeling abundant but you don't feel the need to make a big deal about it like the whale is such a huge animal a huge creature a beautiful creature in its own way and like you know it's like it's just like a a whale is like just so heavy like it just takes up so much space and i feel like this pertains to the big changes coming your way your life is changing in great ways great white shark is that what they're called <laughs> okay i don't know much about animals but what i'm feeling is though there's this like new major beginning that is like slowly creeping up on you much like the whale like that's really what i was saying and i hope that you guys understand what i'm saying but the, the ones who get it get it like you're preparing yourself for something for something big for something significant and it's not going to all happen at once 
is something that's going to be gradual. So look out for signs throughout this journey, throughout this voyage. This is this is a journey. It's like you're packing your bags, you're going on this hike. Along the way, you will meet certain people. They're all part of your journey. They're all part of your story. There's something to learn here, but you're being supported and everything is happening for a reason exactly as it should. There is a bigger plan, a bigger idea for you, water sign. That's why one day this whale is gonna look and be like, wait a minute, I am actually flying. I'm floating on top of the ocean. I have no reason to worry. I have no animals that are trying to kill me. I don't know how it is that I'm uh, a water animal, but I'm actually on top of the water and I'm able to breathe and I'm not like dying because I'm not in water, but somehow the universe is providing for me and I trust my the direction that I'm headed into. I trust it. Gone with the wind. <laughs> Full moon manifestations. A lot of you need to work with moon cycles specifically something about this this upcoming full moon i believe um water magic you know just utilizing like just the element that is water of course i'm talking about the water signs let me see more please let me see more please no like this reading is like no other i'm tapping into some real shit for you I might even make this reading public. Like, I just feel like everyone needs to hear this. There is something better. So there's a better alternative for you, water sign. Success. Success. Just choose choose a better direction. No. If you're getting if you're getting blockages, if you're getting like disruptions, like if things are just not working out, choose a new direction. Change it up. Change it up. Change up your mind. Change your perspective. That's all you gotta do. And then you will, you will see success. The success is yours. It's in the works. You just got to act accordingly and show the world who you really are. And trust, believe yourself. Believe what you think of yourself. Am I really that type of person? Yes, I am. Let me show it. Let me act like it then. Let me act like it. You got the getting to know each other card. I don't care if you've known this person forever or you're just meeting this person, but you are you are getting to know this person. There are more layers that are going to be revealed to you. And this is a good thing, okay? Especially if they are if they or if you are experiencing some type of family issue, if you already have a family with this person, you guys are overcoming your issues. It's safe for you to love. We have romantic feelings in the reversal. Oh, the card fell, sorry. Let me just see the card fell. Make the effort. Yeah, someone here needs to make the efforts to put themselves out there, okay? Um, and to also to express their love. Because someone has feelings. Crosswatcher watching, I don't know if you're the one that has feelings for the, for the water sign, but you need to express yourself, okay? But water sign, say what's on your mind. Speak, speak your mind. Okay, and if you if you're seeking romance and passion, go go out there and, and embrace that energy in every moment of your life in all aspects. Cause you're deserving of that. And that's how you're going to attract it. We have let your friends help you. Like I said, there's some type of support that is given to you. So, you know, if your friends, let's say they suggest therapy, they're like, Oh, I have a great, you know, marriage counselor, I have a great therapist, maybe you should, you know. Or your friends are like, oh, you know, like I did this. Like I had like a similar experience. I had a similar, you know, issue and I tried this. You know, be open-minded to what they have to say. But in order to do that, water sign, you're going to have to vent to them. You're going to have to, you know, open up a little bit, be a little bit more vulnerable to the people that you love and trust. It doesn't have to be a friend. It could be a family member, but someone that you trust, they're going to be able to help you. They may even hook you up with someone. Who knows? We got the engagement card. I see someone asking for your hand in marriage. Someone, again, because I'm seeing something about a blended, a blended family. So someone is making sure that everyone is on the same page and that the people that support you really will show up and show out for you, especially if there's a wedding being planned. Release your ex. This could be the one. And attraction. Living in the moment. Release your ex. Yeah, a lot of you need to just release this this old person so that this new soulmate connection can actually 
come in and flourish because this new per person coming in or your current person that like you really feel connected to they're not playing games so it is in your best interest to open up your heart to them and to not be energetically attached to someone else i don't care if your ex is blocked okay are you still thinking about them talking about them you know like are you still getting like annoyed with them like are you still triggered like this is something that you need to work on it's something that you is worth it for you to release because listen someone this could be the one like this is someone that you could end up marrying water sign this is incredible okay i'm gonna let you go please like comment share i love you guys i love you guys on patreon if i make this public you have to understand this because like literally the message is crazy okay love you guys bye